Okay, hey guys, Halsey here. I'm back and I'm bringing you another episode of Halsey's Paradise. So welcome back to Paradise, guys. Uh, why am I looking at a stone wall? Well, you can probably tell by the bar along the bottom and my sword that I've installed a texture pack. Woohoo! Uh, yeah, this is my first texture pack I've installed. Bear with me one second. I always forget to do this. I start. I always have like a timer going on my phone, so I just have some inkling as to how long I'm recording for otherwise I just keep recording forever <laughs> um, yeah so as you can see texture packs uh, pack is installed it is called I'll show you what it's called now uh, Moray Moray TP resource it's a medieval texture pack basically I've got a couple here uh, just because I downloaded a few that I like to look of and this one is pretty cool as you can see um, the chests and everything, the pictures, some of them are, are mirrors, some are like um, some are like hangers, you know, like those those there look and there's one there as well, so basically this episode I'm just basically going to be showing you, like if you look showing you guys uh, my map in this texture simply because um, I am going to be doing uh, when I showcase my uh, big project to you guys. I'm going to be showcasing it in this texture because I think it looks awesome in this texture pack. So, well, resource pack they're called now, apparently. So, whatever you want to call it. Um, so, yeah, furnaces, crafting table. Basically, this I really like this texture pack. The only bad point about it, I say bad point and obviously it will be fixed because they'll finish it but the t I don't think the texture pack's finished yet because some things they, they haven't changed at all like uh, the food shovels and axes even though they've changed the swords and the pickaxes, there's just some things that just aren't changed like and um, I don't know whether they are going to finish it which I hope they do is it dark out or now we're good to go. So yeah, if you look, these uh, sugar canes look completely different. Uh, they actually look quite cool. So we're, we'll we'll go down uh, to the uh, farm and we'll do a bit down there and have a look at everything down there. And so yeah, I'm just basically giving you guys a feel of this texture pack before I release my big project as I like to call it um, still not going to be out for a couple of days yet maybe even a week because it's, it's taken longer than I thought but it's coming along really well it's coming out a lot better than I thought it was going to um, but I tell you what I'll do as well I'll give you guys a look at this now if you look at what's in my inventory um, all this stuff see if you can guess what my big project is if you have a guess and you'd like to write it in the comment section below please do and we'll see if you're right when I reveal it so as you can see the pigs are different the cows are different uh, the sheep and chickens haven't been changed um, which again, like I said, I hope they do change it because they're. I this texture pack isn't finished yet. I don't think. I think it's like seventy percent complete. The cows look pretty cool, but weird. They're like bulls. <laughs> um, as for the mobs, uh, it's, it's only I've only s seen the spiders are different. I think the um, skeletons, uh, creepers, and zombies are still the same but the enderman I haven't seen yet so but yeah here's the farms guys in this texture they look pretty cool I like the water in this texture pack it's light it's nice and light um, if we look at the kitty hotel the sands quite plain which isn't great but that sandstone which looks weird as well uh, the cats I think are the same yeah they are the same um, I got no fish left. Yeah, I really like the um, like the inventory. Not that. Like on uh, 
Okay, that's not finished either because they would normally have changed this as well. Um, like when you click on the crafting table and that, uh, the the box that comes up then, the crafting uh, selection, whatever you want to call it, that looks really cool. And then the coca beans look really funky and the jungle wood. Um, carrots. And they see they haven't changed anything to do with the potatoes. Uh, what else was I going to say? Oh yeah, if you want to get this resource pack for yourself, go on planet uh, planetminecraft.com or .net or whatever it is. You guys have probably been on there before. Um, and we've still got five minutes left yet. What should we go and do? Let's go do some... No, let's not mine because then I'll have more supplies for my big project. And the idea of it is <clears throat> I try and make it as good as I can with what I've got. Um, anyway, if you want to download this texture pack for yourself, Planet Minecraft, uh, go on the drop down filter menus at the top and click on whatever Minecraft uh, edition it is, the patch or whatever, 1.6.2 obviously because that's the latest one, get that selected, um, then go onto the search bar at the top and type in medieval and then it will be like however many down, it will be in that list, you'll see it and it's called Moray, Moray TP resource, Te medieval Victor slash Victor Victorian. And they have done a an autumn version, which I might as well show you that now as well. Um, uh, this one hasn't got much difference, but if you notice there on the door, there's a butterfly. Uh, the sugar canes are slightly different color, and basically, this is one thing I don't like about this texture pack, which is why I've left the standard um, TP uh, standard moray. The snow. If you look at it, it's like weird and like lumpy. If you get, if you see, um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and switch back to that. See, the snow looks really good in this one, and no butterfly. Oh, I keep forgetting about my fucking pressure plates. All of a sudden, I don't know why. Right, so yeah, like download it. It's a good, it's a good texture pack. Um, you go down here a minute. I really need some more redstone badly because I keep um, I keep running out. Uh, I keep running out. No, what am I on about? I have run out of redstone almost. That's the way to the stronghold. I kind of want to have a look through here a minute. That's the only bad thing about this texture pack is the doors. Um, the doors you can't see through them because whereas normally you look through you look at a door and if there's a mob there you'll see it but you can't with these so that's one bad point but it's something I can live with the torches look really cool in this texture pack gravel looks really weird so there we got gravel that's actually cobblestone which looks amazing in this which is one of the reasons why I've used it for my big project this texture pack that's actually smooth stone and then I'll show you that's stone bricks so they're pretty cool like they've done really well with this texture pack but like I said I, I can't wait until they finish it if they're planning on finishing it because um, that way everything will be in this texture then wow this cave th this goes to the stronghold by the way guys if you didn't watch my enemy stronghold video this cave looks awesome in this texture um, look oh yeah look at the ores there's redstone how cool does that look Oh, I didn't even notice that. Thank you, texture pack. Look at it. That's redstone. How cool. Right. Look, we'll take that because I need redstone, like I said. But, um. What was I gonna say? Yeah, I'll basically be just showing, uh, showcasing my big project in this texture pack, and then I'll probably just switch back to vanilla because, um. Shit, I need to put something down. Um, I'll chuck that shovel because it's about fucked anyway. Um, I'll probably 
uh, so yeah, switch it back to vanilla because that's what I'm used to. Because like, even though I'm kind of used to this texture pack now, um, that still, to me, that looks like stone bricks, but it's not. It's cobblestone, so it's really confusing. But anyway, guys, um, I'm just gonna head back home and do that while I'm going. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Like I said, it was just me giving you guys a feel of this texture pack ready for when I release my big project which should hopefully be in a couple of days or a week maybe could be longer but I don't know I'm trying to get as much done as I can but as you guys know I work a lot um, so yeah I hope you're looking forward to it let me know your thoughts about the big project and what you think it might be by what I've shown you in my inventory and don't forget to rate comment subscribe as always and I will see you in the next episode guys peace out where's the button